Okay guys, today we're gonna make um some stew pork. So I season up, cut up pork, wash it, season it up from yesterday, and marinate it and let it sit with all that nice Caribbean season, herbs, all that stuff is on there. So we did that one. And then we have our banana and our yam over there. So we're gonna make it with some ground provision. And we have our season right here, cut up nicely, really nicely, right there. So we have, we have all our season cut up. And as I said, you know, you use your, 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 your spices, you know, season your pork to your life, I guess, all right? Next time I can show you in my next video the type of season I use, you know, a lot of like ground gar grounded garlic season, Caribbean spice, um, seasoned salt, black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, stuff like that, you know, seasoning up real nice. So there we have our oil pre-eating, you know, and um, bring it up to a nice temperature. Yeah, we're gonna fry them really nice and then we're gonna cook them down with, with all that seasoning and it will be really nice and we're gonna make some dumpling and banana and yam to go with it okay guys simple Caribbean stew pork dish so now our oil is hot I'm gonna go go ahead and put in Put in these to fry. Go ahead and let's put in these pork slices. All that nice seasoning on it is just gonna just make it just nice and rich in flavor. When you cook it down, cook it down with the seasoning too. And remember, I when I season with your powder season, don't really put no salt because, as I say, these seasons are salty. So always remember, you know, cook it down, taste your pot, then you can add your salt. Add your salt last. My my advice to a lot of people out there who's just starting out cooking and stuff, try to add salt to your food is one of the last seasons you will put in. Alright? Let it cook for a little bit, then taste it and you'll figure out how much salt you really need. So we're gonna let that fry. And yeah. So now we have it frying. We have over here, we have the pot going where we're gonna put the yam, the banana, the dumpling, we're gonna add a a little bit of salt, a little bit of salt to the water like right that. Right. Yeah, we're gonna wait for it to come to a boil before we add the, the food in it. All right, so yeah, stay tuned. So I'm just gonna give it a stir in them, show you, fry them up nice. Just stir in them. Fry it up nice. Uh, sometimes I like to fry it real crispy and cook it down and sometimes not so crispy you know, Depends. It's how you want to make how crispy you want to make it. You know? Some people will fry it like normally like this kind of texture and then cook it down because they want that chewy, chewiness to it. Some people just like that crispiness so it's, it's up to you, you understand? Because remember, you're going to cook it again. You're going to cook it down with the seasoning. Alright. When you do that, you just turn them nicely. Alright. Let them cook um, even. Yeah. You, know, you want to always make sure you get even fire um, on, the, on whatever you're cooking. You cook it uniform, very even. You know, for a better eat. 
So we have the food pot boiling, so we're gonna go in and add in our banana and our yam. Okay. Hold on. Put this in and then wait for a little bit, then you add your dumplings in. Go guys. We're almost there. So next we put in the dump in and the next step cook this down and then you're gonna see me plate it and you see what it looks like. So now guys the pork is finished fried. So we're gonna cook it down now. So what we're gonna do We're going to add in the pork, just like that. We're going to add on the water. And the seasoning. I'm gonna add a little bit more powder seasoning on it. Your seasoning salt, your black pepper, your grounded garlic, all that stuff. You're gonna add a little bit more, and then you're just gonna cover it up and let it cook down. And you're gonna add some of the oil. Steam oil. It fries in. Just want to pour a little bit of the oil on it, just to give it that, yeah. Yeah, just like that. And what I was to say, we're gonna add on some more seasoning and let it cook down. Cover it and let it cook, and that's that would be it. So you just let that cook down, just like that. Just let it cook down, nice. Come to a nice texture, nice gravy. Taste it, see what it's missing. Add it in, you know, as you go along. There you go guys, cooking down nicely and you can see the dumpling in the pot now and this is cooking down, as I said it's going to cook down, come to a nice gravy. Um, so stay tuned, I'll show you the finished product when I'm finished, so it's, it's, coming, it's coming to a finishing right now, it's, it's coming to a finish, so let's um, wait for it a little bit and then we will see it. Here you go guys, that's the finished product. Yeah, that's the finished product right there. Stew pork, dumpling and banana, Jamaican style. There you go. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Please like, share and subscribe.